coming from the intake is sucking so it's working so Good morning everyone. Today we have a special trick to install the drum pump. So uh, my friend is going to install right away. So uh, our fear is need the water. So uh, we in reinstall the drum pump here to get the water for our right field. So please watch our installation right away. Thank you. Okay, so um, Mr. Kom already set up the drum and the stand. It already firm and now we're going to install the intake water pipe so uh, the intake water pipe need to be filled in the water inside and the, the end of the intake pipe we have the valve check over there now it's already filled the water and what we're going to install is we need a we need uh, the wall here and here is the the way that we can fill in the water into the drum and this we will use this to connect from the drum like this and here is uh, the pipe that we're going to connect from here to here so uh, you can just see when I finish installation I will review for you what we have done with this so it's a come starting to install right away Okay, so right now Mr. Kong already installed the intake water pipe. So as you can see, it's very easy. But make sure you use the the glue that uh, can ensure that the airproof or waterproof is flat. It's not leaking air in in this inside the intake water pipe because it's very important for the drum pump. If the air is leaking, will not working. So uh, this here is for the water fill in at the first time that. This is the empty drum, so we have to fill in by this way. So uh, right now we're going to uh, install the output water. So let's see what we're going to install on the other side. So we already complete the intake water installation. So now, right now we start to install output water. Before we install the output water, we need to uh, install the air pipe. This is uh, the, uh, the air pipe and we put this one because we, we can fill in the water. Either we can install it in over there or here. And when we we open the valve, out, output valve, we need to close all this one. So we, we make sure the glue is... is uh, Okay, you can install it. Can you explain everything? So, uh, Mr. Kong will install, and after install this one, he will install this uh, output pipe to to go to the right field. So, okay, we start to install in progress right now. So we can show you next when we already installed. Okay, so uh, my team already installed the uh, the air pipe and output pipe. So here, uh, this is the master valve that uh, when we fill in the water, we need to close the master valve here. And this is the 60 millimeter uh, output pipe. And what we have installed a new, what is the different be from before uh, that we used to do is we have the special air pipe here. So actually, uh, the last video that we made is uh, double air pipe the ball what called air pipe but today we just put one air pipe but we use this drum to to store the air when the water run this one is pressed with the air and when the bubble come back from the output so here is the install the water stopping here 
the, the water never go back to the drum so this is we got new experience that uh, uh, we always get success we never fail with our installation so this is the new idea that everyone need to try with this method so we're going to continue installation anyway Okay, so now the installation is complete and what we have to do is we, we need to fill in the water until... Stop, stop, stop. We need to fill in the water until uh, 80 or 70 percent of the drum. So before we install uh, the water, we need to close the master valve here. Uh, motor or the pump machine. So we need to use our energy to carry the water until 70 or 80 percent of the drum. So if you have any DC motor, you can use that idea, but we don't have, so uh, my team is like exercise, so he will carry this one until 80% and the water will always run 24 hours, 7 days a week. With. So you need to do exercise 80%, but I will have you. I can do 30. can have you about 30 basket so when uh, the water installation complete I will show you uh, the result how is it work this is the 30 basket that I have done with the water I have him because he got about more than 40 already and I got about more than 30 30 I think is one and I hope it will full soon oh it seems like full okay 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 so it's already almost full this one Let me try again if it can feel it. Okay. Oh. It's full. So the water is full right now. We have done everything complete. Water and installation. What we have to do right now is we need to close all the valve for the air. For the air valve, we'll close all. Okay. All right, so uh, what we're going to do is open the output valve here to get water to, to use output. Oh, this is start pressing. The water is sucking from down to here. If, as you can hear the sound, it, it is pressing the, the pump, the drum pressing the drum and the, the water is start sucking from the inlet inlet water pipe so you can you can hear the sound and this one is starting pressing the air is full of full of the drum here so almost explode I can I can't stay here I afraid that open the valve over there and I open here so the water is already arrived here. I'm going to open right away. So at the first time it will be about strong because it's no gravity yet. But if not, the intake is not stuck, it will stop immediately. The water will not come because it, it already stuck at the intake. But if, if this one still coming, mean that the water replacement from the intake is sucking so it's working so you can 
So at the first time, it's very strong. Wow! It is very strong. So, let's wait about 15 minutes. It's still coming. It will working 24 hours, so one day a week. It's running. The water is dropping. You can hear the water dropping from from the inlet into this one. Everyone can hear. So we're going to check the wild check. Oh no, it's not wild check. The, the air, the air bag over there. So the water is coming from the river into the drum, and it can. So this is. Full of the air right now, but the water has come up a little bit here because a lot of air, the bubble come back from the from output and it pressing here. It stopped the water here and it pushing back. So the water at the output is very strong. It's going very strong. Okay, it's working right now. So I wait about. 15 minutes and I will review again at the at the output water if still running it means that it's working but if stop running it's not working so just wait 15 minutes okay I can hear the sound the water running <laughs> it works. Okay. This is the gravity water. So you know, uh, it works. I I I have wait about 30 minutes already, and include our starting the first about 10 minutes more. So about 40 minutes, more than 40 minutes, and the water still still coming like this. It's not very strong because it. The heavy of the intake water pipe going up to the drum, so it's just like this speed. But this is work because, as our experience, if the water is not work, it will stop about five minutes. It stop coming even the water in the drum have half drum also stop working because it's stuck. The air is stuck. So here it's working because it's not stuck. The gravity of the output pipe can draw the water from the river to the drum so it's working 24 hour a week so it's still working so tomorrow our farm will full of the water that we can grow the dry the right so it's working right now everyone can try our method and can review our uh, installation one step by step to make sure that you can do it if you can't do it you can review again to make sure you're not missing any spot of our installation and thank you very much for watching our tutorial today and we have a lot of tutorial about the water free energy water pump like similar like this every day subscribe if you love our content thank you very much